Good morning, friends and fellow farmers. Oh, I forgot Claire's. Oh, Claire, I'm so sorry. I was. Uh, I got busy with Andy's quest, and then I, uh, you know, stuff happens. And then uh, next thing you know, you're murdering crabs at late at night, and you forget to do people's birthdays. That's uh, annoying. I feel bad. Uh, oh no, I, I ran out of. Yeah. Let me just run out of water for a sec. Okay. So we uh, gotta check here how many we end up getting. I got 26. I'm halfway there. Well, we got a few last time, didn't we? They came out like really late. That was the thing. It was uh, surprisingly late. Basically, the right uh, close to the end of night is when they appeared. Uh, it would be nice to have the return scepter to do that quest, because then you could really just go right to the last second. Do we can. 26? I don't know. Maybe? That is like, what, four a day? Five a day? Four and a bit? It's possible. Anything's possible, but I'm not gonna hold my breath. I don't think I have any other fish. I do have any crabs here. Yeah, there we go. Now, do I have any. I haven't done much in the way of cooking here, have I? Oh, we can make some roasted hazelnuts to give to uh, Kent. He's back in town, isn't he? Uh, dear Mount Hodge, when we come today, we'll hold in the Stardew Valley Fan at Town Square. It's the biggest event of the year, drawing people from all across the country to our humble town. If you'd like to, you can set up a grand display for the event. Just bring up to nine items that best showcase your talents. You'll be judged on the ability, quality, and diversity of your display. Fair starts at 9 a.m. Don't miss it. Mayo Lewis. Oh my gosh, Kitty, I'm so sorry. I think I forgot to give you water yesterday. I hope you didn't have to struggle to forge your way through the world. Okay, I'm just going to pop these in here because why not uh, and in terms of our bars of stuff there's a few bars here okay let's put our resources away we got a few things and uh, I mean it is nice that the crabs drop off explosives it does concern me that the crabs are walking around the world with explosives though why are we arming crabs? That's my question. Who's doing this? They must be stopped. I can do 18 more kegs. Um, do I want to do 18 more kegs? Yeah, I think I do. And I can do... Um, I can do one cask. Okay, yeah, that's the thing. I used all my wood doing that. So I need to go get more wood. <laughs> that's the conclusion I'm going to come to. Okay. The danger of doing this live is that if uh, I place one in the wrong spot and it fills up, I'll have to wreck it, which would stink. Okay, and then I don't quite have enough stuff to go in there. That's that's perfect. That's the amount of stuff we like to have. That said, probably almost done. I'm just going to wait. You know, I'm just going to give it a chance to all kind of come in at once. That's all, all I'm going to do. Okay, um, just in the crab minutes. So that's all I'm working on. Well, well, well. Look, crabs. How are we doing here? Okay, I got an extra diamond. Let's load this one up finally. And how's it going here, my little critters? I seriously can't even see that you... There's no way can uh, you guys can eat all this for one, but I can't even uh, make my way. Oh, uh, there we go. I can't even find the the truffles in the midst of this. Careful, just do a little jump. It's like skipping rope, but a lot more dangerous. You guys are good. They know what they're doing. You're professional goats. I get it. Um, how are you all doing? You're holding together. Things are good. 
Now, I guess one question, because we did a bunch of fishing. I, I don't think we had hit that next fishing level, had we? Maybe we have to. I don't even know. Let's see here. No, we're really close. I think I'm just going to let the the uh, crab pots do the thing. Um, Pam Vincent. Okay, Pam Vincent Demetrius. Sophia. Jazz Victor. Wow, okay, we're moving. It's it's moving along. So, yeah, the uh, the unusuals. The, uh, the crowd that we... We always leave. It's not the unusuals. It's the uh, the forgotten bulk of the town. Those we don't interact with on a day-to-day -day basis. We need to go and uh, pay them a little bit of a visit here. We have some mushrooms. Hello. Yeah, again, I'm not entirely sure what my objective is here. I think I don't, I don't really have one. I think is the thing. Oh, there. That's pretty nice. We can kind of walk on water. There we go, got a fishing buff today. Now I wonder if that makes my crab pots more useful. I wonder. Okay, so let's um, cut this down, but we'll go this way. Perfect, all right. So I do need more wood. That's the thing I could be doing. It's the thing I probably should be doing. Uh, now I can head down through... Let's go down here. Look at all this stuff. Uh, do I need all this? No, not really. Oh, okay. Good. Stone's in the way. That's good. Let's just leave this be. Um, we're just gonna go down here. Does this lead me out? It's a lot of slimes. They're everywhere. Okay, yeah, there we go. Perfect. So let's have ourselves a cup of coffee. And let's just clear out a few things here. What I love is that this is just going to take like a couple minutes and we'll have cleared out half this forest. Yeah, I definitely like that, not having to replant forests and all the things you don't have to spend time on. That's why it is, it's a very different game playing like this because you're, I don't play with any of the same objectives. It's definitely changed the way I'm thinking about the game a lot. Um, it would be, I, I think I would have a hard time. Well, no, I wouldn't. I, I do enjoy the, I enjoy the early game. I like the little challenges, but they, they do become like less interesting when you can do the weird stuff you can do in modded. It just opens up so many more possibilities. clear all this out. Again, yeah, I don't know what's going to be a good amount of wood. All of it, probably. It's about the amount I'm looking for. A lot of mushrooms down here. Fall is a friendly season here. work of that. Alright, and we got more, more hazelnut. Yeah, I gotta go and uh, see Kent, and uh, again, I think he's back, isn't he? I hope he is. But again, even gifting everybody the things isn't really as relevant uh, in this one. It's more about, uh, it's really the newcomers are more interesting because that's the stories we really want to see. It's hard not to want to, to you know, deal with all of the, uh, the old timers there. Oh. 
Oh, well, look who it is. Mr. Andy. Uh, bud, I've got you a, uh, oh boy. <laughs> what do I have here that I want to... How's it going, buddy? This ain't bad. Thank you for having me for the gift. I don't turn my crops into artisan goods like beer, wine, fair haven, pride itself, and supplying high quality raw crops. Maybe you can teach me how to use some of those contraptions sometime. You betcha, buddy. Raw crops. He's just to the source. That's what he's all about. Okay, let's head on over and see if we can get ourselves some crabs at this point. We've gifted Sophia twice, so we won't be doing any of that. I'm guessing you could get yourself a thousand blackberries a day. <laughs> it feels like there's an unlimited quantity waiting for you uh, out there. I can't even imagine how many you can get in one day. Okay, what we need to do now is uh, forage. Yeah, let's uh, definitely a few mushrooms there. Crystal items, crafting, I don't know, maybe. Crab pot, chest, wood and stone. There we go. So what are we looking at? 900 wood now. That's a solid amount of wood. Oh, yeah, well, we got a little bit of fodder, uh, like almost 5,000. That's the right amount. Uh, processing, I don't think I had anything there. Oh, yeah, there we go, okay. And Olivia Quest, well, that's no longer a good description for this. And we're back at gifts, aren't we? All right. Good enough. How's my coffee holding out? I feel like it should be good. Now, who's out and about here? Sam. I've, I've gifted Sam up, haven't I? Yeah, we don't need to say hi. We can keep on moving here. Plenty of folks to go see. My dude, I think I've visited you a lot. Okay. This is wonderful and I am grateful. My apologies if I seem short of temper. Baron Munching then procured a mouse last night and threw the whole household in utmost chaos. I barely slept a wink. Baron, Baron Munchington seems like uh, a handful. Oh, Evelyn, we haven't... Uh... Oh, my looks wonderful. That's sweet of you. Okay, um... My dude. I shouldn't get depressed about my legs. I should be happy that I'm still alive. Well, that's... I, I... You know. Yeah. No, that's good. That's good perspective. Don't often hear that. Uh, how's it going, bud? Um, I don't have anything really good here. Up here. Sometimes I get new items in stock. Make sure to stop by every so often. Okay, Olivia. I, I here have a coffee. This is so thoughtful of you, sweetie. The beauty of yoga is the enhanced flexibility it gives you. Working the fields on your farm will certainly keep your muscles toned too. I, I guess we should be saying that in a purring tone. I feel like that's where we're headed. Uh, Robin, how are you doing? Now I've gifted Robin up, right? Yep. Victor, giving this to me? This is great. Having a dilemma with the project I'm coding has to do with the compiling here. Good luck with that. Good luck. I gotta go get crabs. Martin. I like this, thanks. Morris. This is delightful. Now, uh, keeping the good stuff for myself here. Let's have one of our triples. Alright, I've got some stuff to go do. Gotta go see uh, about some crabs. So last time was a pretty good crab day. I I think. As crab days go. See how this one goes. I hope it matters like what time we enter town. Yeah, I don't know any if any of the if there's any variables that make this whole thing easier. What was a 
Okay. Let's just have enough of my gifting. Cool your jets, pal. It's funny how everybody's like, no, no, that's just too much. Please stop. No, I said, please stop. Please stop gifting me. Listen, I don't want to get a restraining order against you, farmer, but uh, it's a bit much. Yeah, too many gifts. Just too many gifts. Some people say thoughtful. Other people say less kind things. Um, and again, I'm sure there's crabs all over here hiding. It's only when I see him moving. So I, I should be striking everything and get trying to hit that cling 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 sound. some up here, but it ain't happening. But I guess it depends on the day. I'm sure there is days when you find lots of uh, goodies hiding up there. Alright, um, I'm sure let's boogie on this way again. 10.30 already? Oh man. I think I got out here a little bit late. It's not good. Hello, Doc. Oh, there we go. There's one there. Oh, nice. Can kind of do a jump shot and get that thing. There's another one there. You think the pickaxe would would take it out? Because that's like quite a bit of force. Okay, I almost just need to look for really obvious ones at this point, I think. Eleven thirty. Yeah. Um there's one here. Okay, here's two more. Beautiful. Three more. Hey. Look at that, one just popped in while we were standing there. Huh. Well, that's interesting. So I guess knowing that a certain number will spawn in down here, I just have to, like, loiter down here. Um, it's interesting is that those big stones are kind of deceptive. Here's another one. Okay, I think we're getting our quota today. I mean, what do I have? I got 35. We got 9. Here's 10. Eleven. Okay, finally, yeah, we're having a this is a good day. Oh boy, here we go, bonanza. Huh. Again, that poor dog. One of these days, dog, if you're not careful. Okay, and we go. Oh no, I gotta. Oh, we just got a cutscene with Morris here. That's nice. My key won't work. Defective garbage. Mod Hodge, you're out awfully late. You know. That I'd, uh, what's that? You want me to try locking try locking the door for me? I'm telling you, this key is a useless piece of... Click. Oh. How did you? Ah, I was putting the key in at a wrong angle. Heh. <laughs> it has been a very busy day. Nothing a good five hours of sleep can't solve. Why are you working such long hours? You should go home and rest. Thank you for assisting in locking the door. If I missed the late night shuttle, I'd have to sleep at my desk again. Good night. 
sleep at my desk again. Okay, I teleported into town. There we go. Uh, bus stop. Well, that's nice that we chose the wrong one by accident in a way. Got to see that cutscene. And uh, shockingly, I think we've made it home again. <laughs> I don't think we'll make it to bed, but... No, we did. Beautiful. We actually get a good night's sleep and have some energy. All right. See you all next time. Till then. Bye-bye.